Hey, hey guys, welcome, welcome back to my channel. So I'm bringing you another great opportunity to work from home again. So if you're interested, you know what to do, apply now. And then also don't forget to share to help others who may be needing a remote position, okay? So the name of this company is Hey House Careers and they're hiring customer care representative positions. Once again, it's remotely and it's in the United States. The sal salary range is $20 hour hourly, of course. Um, it is for an experienced person who has worked in this level of customer care representative, which is in tech support, okay? And so it's fully remote and the educational level would be high school diploma, okay? So that's all you need to work for this company. And it is a customer service position as well. All right, so let's get more into it and talk more about the technical support customer service position that you're going to be doing here with the company. So the responsibilities and expertise are as follows. It's not much, but it is a little bit of um, technical savvy troubleshooting that you will need to do. So you're going to troubleshoot and resolve technical issues. You're going to have to communicate and report user feedback to department managers. And then also, you also need to be able to meet and exceed personal and team sales goals. There may be other duties assigned to you, but of course your managers and supervisors, they will let you know that if that's something that may come up. And then you're going to be processing orders, refunds, exchanges, and also processing cancellations. And then also you do need to be able to prioritize your workflow based on the support and channel demand. You're going to be the first contact resolution or first call resolution. That means that the customer will reach you first. So if there needs to be like an escalation, something that you can't handle, then you'll transfer to someone else to a different level. All right, so, but you're the first um, person or contact that the customer meets with, okay? All right, so you're going to be providing professional customer support communication, and that's going to be via email, live chat, and phones, okay? So, also, you need to be someone that's able to handle large volume of calls. What that means is if you're someone that doesn't like back-to-back -back calls, then you might not want to do this job. But if you're someone that does not like to just sit there and wait for calls to come through and you need to keep busy so the time can go by fast, then large volumes of calls will be something that you're interested in, okay? That means you're going to have a job too, all right? So you're going to be handling those calls and then emails and also live chats. So you do need to be a little bit um, able to too tight dealing with live chats because you know that's not on the phone you're going to be typing so that part there you'll need to have a little bit of skills in typing all right so that's pretty much it guys that's it it's not much to it you just need to be capable all right and able so skills knowledge and abilities so once again, excellent customer service skills. You need to be technical savvy. You need to be someone with a cheery and upbeat personality, okay? Because you do get customers that call in and they're irate and upset and frustrated. And you need to be able to handle that. Also, the ability to maintain a positive attitude under pressure. Once again, you need to be self-motivated you know, with the ability to work independently because you're not always going to have a supervisor that's going to hover over you. So you need to be able to work independently, okay? Outstanding listening skills. You need to be able to understand what the customer wants and be be able to help them with that, okay? And identify that need and meet it, all right? You need to be someone that's excellent in problem solving, troubleshooting, and tech savvy, once again, and then also be able to be effectively multitasking and be able to prioritize your responsibilities as well. So once again, manage large volume of incoming calls, live chats, and emails. You need to be able to demonstrate critical thinking and decision-making process. So you need to be able to make a decision when speaking to the customer on what the next steps should be. All right, to meet the need. Strong attention to detail, strong drive to succeed as a team member as well, and then maintain exceptional attendance. So that means, you know, basically guys show up, right, for work if you want that job, okay? All right, once again, high school diploma is the minimum educational experience that you need. Um, you need at least two years of prior work experience with like online web customer support, voice software, email ticketing system, live chat, and other CRMs, all right? And then prior experience in technical support once again, and then on some experience in working remotely, okay? They need to know that you're able to navigate and you are comfortable working from home, all right? So then also prior experience in Zendesk, talk, live chat, and support ticketing system, all right? So it's not saying that it's a 
a requirement, but it is saying that experience is something that they're looking for, okay? But it didn't say that it's a requirement. But if you have this experience, I recommend you to put that on your resume or update it, okay? All right, so there you go and there you have it, guys. The next thing to do is you see over here where it says um, apply now. You put your name, your information, email address, of course. Um, you don't have to put your phone number because there is no asterisk there, so it's not required but everything else is, all right? And then you can attach your resume, of course, and then click Start Application and then proceed to continue if this is a job that you want, okay? All right, well, i like to thank you so much for tuning in. Guys, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe and always share with someone else who may need a job, okay? Pay it forward, all right? Thank you so much, and you have a beautiful day. Ciao.